Hey, how are we doing everybody and welcome back to the catalyst where we break down all things bullish in the crypto markets today i figured it would be a good day to go over all the 25 days of flexa uh, this was kind of a little promotional event uh they used to just do some announcements and uh you know confirm some partnerships or deals or whatever they had or just mostly a lot of assets being added and supported to the flexa network uh so day one was solana being added day two <clears throat> was uh some 20 percent savings if you use flexa at regal cinemas then going forward here day three they added die four was sushi swap being added as well day five was uh both matic and scale being incorporated uh six was luna and terra uh seven is diversity uh in blockchain uh, so this is, I believe it's a uh, non-profit organization. So they uh, did some sort of uh, donations to that, uh, it seems. Oh, uh, yeah, they donate $10,000. $10, uh, all right. So then day six was Algorand, Link, and Matic again. Uh, now available on the Spedden app. So that is good. Uh, nine was a bunch of DeFi support. So... Ave, one inch, uh, you know, bond, all this stuff here. 10 was the announcement of SHIB, which I'm sure people were pretty excited about. 11 was FIL meeting Flexa as well. Then crypto.com got supported on day 12. Uh, Avalanche on day 13. Uh, there was a um, like discussion video and an AMA on the Twitter space. Um, on day 13 or day 14 rather uh and that's with tyler spaulding and uh, you know so the creator here uh with uh do Kwan. uh then day 15 was more nft assets being added so engine uh origin protocol super rare etc so that that was a big one in my opinion uh, adding a lot of nft platforms it just shows that they want to uh get involved with the metaverse and uh, stuff of that nature, in my opinion. Uh, then, you know, this was another big one, GameStop being back. Uh, again, Metaverse uh, coins being added, Mana, Sandbox, Axie Infinity. Uh, so that was huge, obviously. Uh, ADA being added to the list on the 17th. Uh, Loop Ring then on the 18th. Uh, so that is already kind of confirming some previous thoughts that people had. Uh, for some loop ring and some amp and some uh, GameStop kind of trifecta situation happening there. Fox token on the 19th, uh, PAX dollar and PAX gold on the 20th. The 21st was some stable coins. The 22nd, let's go up here, uh, basic attention token. The 23rd, uh, teaming up with Gemini to offer flex rewards. Tomorrow, today and tomorrow, so the I guess uh, the last two days, say 25% when you pay with Gen Gemini mobile app. So that is enormous. That uh, I'm sure if people utilize that, they uh, made some great savings. Uh, some more donations being made, $50,000 to Coin Center, um, you know, and these listed here. Uh, so give crypto and look at hungry St. Jude Hospital. And the last day, 30 more new digital assets added. Uh, so ANKR, ASH, burn token, ASM, assemble, and I'm sure plenty, plenty more uh, that we see here. All of them tagged. Dojilon, uh, you know, a bunch of uh, cryptos, Quant, NKN, uh, across the board. So they have now accomplished their goal of enabling more digital assets on Flexo. Uh, more than any available on any other platform, uh, payment networks. Uh, and they are one important step closer to the mission of making it possible to use any asset in any app at any store in the world. Uh, so they are one third of the way to that kind of mission statement that they have. Um, and then it's just a big thank you saying happy holidays. Um, and they're going to take a break for the next you know, couple days, rest for the holiday, and look forward to some of the goals for 2022. 
uh, and if i believe if i remember correctly some of the goals were inclusion of banks and everything like that and they have also checked off some of the boxes there uh to start to achieve that goal but now um this kind of just gives us a projection for it as to what they're doing so now next step is possibly how is flex are going to be used on any app um so that could be potential uh partnerships with coinbase partnerships with uh kraken other spending apps uh, you know, maybe partnerships with like PayPal or um, WhatsApp and, and other other apps that allow for crypto transactions. Uh, Flexit is probably going to target those next. Uh, and then from there, uh, add a lot more e-commerce stuff. So at any store in the world, that next phase would be targeting Walmart, Amazon, uh, all the big box stores and kind of everything in between those things i just mentioned so this is pretty exciting news uh let's take a look at the price i believe it's been pretty flat um for some time now uh, i think what we're looking at mostly now is continued consolidation we've really been just consolidating since back here so uh since august uh we've had a couple spikes with some news announcements but nothing crazy enough to really drive the price up um and like we've always said, accessibility and utility um, and just adoption of the Flexa network is going to be with a true driver of the price, not this hype news stuff and not necessarily FUD. So going back to what they just said, their next goals being being able to be incorporated on any app that alone is going to drive the price up a bit and then obviously as it gets incorporated into more stores and more merchants that will uh, you know continue to drive it up as well so uh look for some of that news to come out uh as a way to really really drive the price crazy for amp uh, but ultimately i think we're going to continue consolidating you could see some positive upticks uh if we kind of find some support at some previous levels here break through some fib levels you know hopefully we can flip the 20 ema into support uh, and that would be good enough uh in terms of just like okay it's not gonna go you know to zero basically but uh you know we're looking for ways to continue to consolidate uh and accumulate and that's kind of where we've been at since august like i said uh, so anything in this range seems kind of like a healthy buy i would just dollar cost average in if you're really convicted on you know the fact that amp is going to be a big player so if you feel that way, this is a good time to continue to load your bags a bit. Uh, and then we'll kind of just see what happens over the next uh, few months here as we enter 2022. Uh, but otherwise, that's all I got for you guys today. Happy holidays and happy new year. And we'll catch you on the next one. Thanks for watching. Peace.